guys. So I am super excited because we are going to Oaxaca. <laughs> Oaxaca is in Mexico and is this beautiful city that is really known for its culture, but mainly is known for its food. Um, there's these amazing creative chefs there. We're not talking about a taco, just a taco. This is a very elevated experience. This is a very elevated creative and I've just, I've been hearing a lot about it lately and I, I love food. <laughs> so any opportunity, any trip for me to try food, I'm there, even though I am vegan, but when it's for something that's worth it, I'm all in baby, I'm all in. And I know the food here is supposed to be really good. I don't know if we're gonna have any time to digest because our itinerary is like from one restaurant to the next. So I can't wait to share that with you guys. But in the meantime, I gotta pack. And that's why I'm in my packing mode right now. But I wanted to share with you guys my essentials. Like the things that it doesn't matter where I go, they always go with me. To be honest with you, even if it's like a two day weekend thing, I always take these essentials. And you know, I don't know, they might help you. You might discover something new. So here they go. So here are my essentials. Um, I'm gonna start with the fun part, <laughs> makeup. So I am in love with this palette. It's called I Am Essentials by Modus Cosmetics. And you can find this in shop.com or moduscosmetics.com. What I love about this is the size. I, I like makeup, okay? Some people walk around with a little bag of makeup, like three things. I need more than that. Obviously, I got no makeup on. But um, what I like about this is you get everything in one, like literally everything. So you don't have to pack other stuff. Um, these are the eyeshadows. And by the way, you could see how I use this. Like wherever I go, these are the perfect colors because you can take it from day to night as casual as you want it, as dramatic, because as you can see, you have the black that you can use as a shadow. I like to use it as an eyeliner. So what I do is I have setting spray and I wet the brush a little bit with the setting spray and then you use the shadow as an eyeliner and it doesn't mess up, it doesn't clunk up the shadow. These are, these are really good quality. And of course you have the two metallics, the gold and the rose. So you have two, two different undertones that you can take it from day to night in two seconds. So this is super important. I love, love this. Okay, then the second palette is, I uh, sorry, blushes. So you get powder brushes here, and these are all lipsticks that can be, that you can use as blush. So you can use it as lipsticks or blush, and it gives you a nice natural look. Especially when you have to wear a lot of foundation. <laughs> um, and then finally, you have the contouring. We all like to contour. And you also have the highlighters. I like to use these with, our, with the eyeshadows too, so it gives you different looks. And honestly, sometimes I just use this. I use these as eyeshadows, as everything, and highlighter, and that's really all that you need. Sometimes I just travel with the first and the second, I don't even do the lipstick. So I, I love, love these, okay? This is an essential, basically, that everybody should have, whether you're traveling or not. So that's one of my favorites. Um, I like to start with makeup. And, but before you put on your makeup, this is, it doesn't matter whether I'm traveling or not. I love this sunblock. Um, you know, if you could see it, it's tinted. But honestly, it's tinted very little. When you first put it on, it gives you that white, like little glow, which to be honest with you, for me, I'm okay because look, I'm not wearing any makeup and you see that I have spots in my face. So I need to wear sunblock because the sun will make my spots worse. And I don't care if it has a little bit of that cast. Once you put on the makeup, it goes away. It really is not bad but I've tried a lot of um, sunblocks and this is, I feel like one of the ones that have really helped protect 
my spots from getting darker. Um, that's a whole nother conversation. <laughs> um, what else, what else do I have here that's important? So on the plane, on the plane, as you know, our face, our skin gets, tends to get dry because of the altitude, you just get dehydrated. And I just keep this in my purse anyway. So this is by Lumiere de Vie, which you can also get at shop.com or you can go to Lumiere de Vie website. Um, this is, okay, right here. And this is rose water. And this is so nice because it hydrates the skin. It wakes up the skin. When you're traveling, you just spray here. Oh, there we go. <laughs> oh, it smells so, first of all, it smells so good. It smells like roses. Um, it just rehydrates you and wakes you up. And I, I just, I love it. It's so good for the skin. So that's one of my musts. I always, always have it. Another must is my lips. My lips get so dry. And I've tried so many different things. I do like the um, Elizabeth Arden, the eight hour cream. It's long. Um, it doesn't smell that great. It's supposed to be good for the face too, but it's, it's a lot. And I use it as a gloss. Actually, I learned that from Eva Longoria because <laughs> she uses it. And I used it for many years, but I just wanted to try something different. And I found this one. You see it? I love the smell. It doesn't really give you a rosy tone to it. I actually have it on right now, but it's very hydrating because it says it's a mask, but I use it on top of my lipstick. I have it in my purse all the time. I, another product is a must. Okay, when it comes to travel, like specifically travel, I do use this every day, but you can't leave without it. It's probiotics. Okay, now we're getting, <laughs> we're getting deep in here. You know that when you travel, you know, you are eating different foods that your system's not used to, and we get a little bit more bloated than we want to. Um, so this is going to help strengthen your gut. It's gonna help digest and break down the foods. It's going to save your life, especially when you're over 50, I think over 40, definitely after menopause. Your whole system changes and you need probiotics. I'm telling you, it's gonna help with your bloat. And another product, and also here you can look at it, is, it has the 10 strains, which is what you wanna look for. And this, you can also get it in shop.com. Um, yeah, I'm a big fan. <laughs> another product that goes, and two different products, they're totally different products, is the digestive enzymes. Do you see it? There, yeah. Digestive Enzymes by Isotonics. You also get it at shop.com. And the reason why I love this, it's also because it helps break down the food. It's a whole different thing. It's not the same thing. It's so easy to travel with. Um, you can take it to the restaurant, so you can have take it before. It's, you should, you should take it during the day, before a big meal. Sometimes, if I forget, I'll just take it at night. It really does help, it helps with digestion especially especially when you're traveling and and you're just eating different things that your body's not used to so if you don't take these regularly at least take them when you're traveling um i like to take this too and these are different vitamins as you could see it has opc which it's good for everything. We'll get into that later, but it has multivitamins. It has vitamin B, all your vitamin Bs, because I'm vegan, so I do need to take that supplement. And vitamin Bs is great. It gives you extra energy, and when you're traveling, you're out and about, a little extra energy does not hurt. And then of course, calcium. Calcium is good. Um, a lot of us are deficient, especially when we're in our 50s, 40s, 50s and I don't leave home without it, it's easy travel. So these are my musts. I don't know what your musts are, but hopefully, you know, maybe you learned something here. Okay, this is a little weird, <laughs> but you know that when you travel, it doesn't matter how old you are, but sometimes it's harder to go to the bathroom, you know, and it's uncomfortable and I want to enjoy my vacation. That's why I take my probiotics and my 
uh, digestive enzymes. But another little trick, just in case, and I learned this from a nurse, okay? This is not, I didn't just make it up. I don't drink coffee, so I don't know how it would taste in coffee, but I drink tea, and I just pack in a little, like, coconut oil. Uh, unrefined coconut oil, and it's natural, and I put a little bit, like, I don't, like a dime size of coconut oil, I put it in my tea. The oil, it helps you go to the bathroom. It's worked for me. I'm giving you the tip. Not sure if it's gonna work for you. I hope it does <laughs> if you take it, don't judge me. But I mean, we're talking about my must, not yours. So this is my must. And another thing that I just, I like to do when I buy perfume, I like to get little samples. So when I travel, I don't have to worry if it breaks and just put it in your purse. And I, I think a lot of us do that, but I do do that. And now my new favorite are these sunglasses because I like the case. I like that it's small, but what I like is look how the sun, these are Fendi. See how they come in? So I feel like there's less chance of the sunglasses breaking or cracking, especially when you're packing them if, if you don't wanna take the case. I mean, I know that's what the case is there for, hello. But sometimes you don't have room. So they're cute, right? So these and usually I don't read that much. I don't have time, but I'm trying to get into reading a little bit more. And I love creativity. I love anything, self-help, anything that, I don't know, just opens my mind to new experiences. So I heard this book is good. It's called The Creative Act, A Way of Being. Um, being creative. And this is what I'm reading. I just started it. I'm gonna take it with me so I can read it in the, in the plane. And these are my musts. So I'll, when I get back, I'll tell you all about my trip. We're super excited and talk to you soon. Mm -hmm.